It's for me and Anthony and David and Rebecca. So happy super late birthday, Kathy! Yay. Woo! Okay. Ready? Oh, I love this thing so much. Where's the hole? Anthony, you gotta make a yeah. hole. <laughs> yeah, make a hole. I got some porn first. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, I got you a giant box of porn. <laughs> Olivia, why? In China. Go, Kathy! <laughs> There's so much tape! <laughs> yeah. yeah. How am I supposed to open it? <laughs> Your fingers? Open it. And teeth. And other accessories. Get the bite. <laughs> oh my god, it's a giant! It's what cute! You <laughs> So, um, well, that's my first video, actually my second one, but the first one here, six hours ahead of you. Um, I have, I don't have a lot to say, a lot to say, because like, um, I flew from New York to Frankfurt in Germany, and then from Germany to here. Um, so I don't know, it was kind of time just to think, and I thought a lot. And to realize what I'm doing and it was kind of awkward because like um, I felt like this year had gone by like really fast and sometimes it was like no that never happened it was just a dream like a long long dream but I don't want it to be a dream and I want it to be reality and I know you're here even if far far away and I'm here too so please keep in touch and because I'll make sure I will do it I know what I was gonna say, oh yeah, I'll keep in touch and then never write anything. I just had my goodbye party today and I had to say bye to all my friends. But it's not a goodbye, it's just a see you later. I really hope I'll be able to see them again soon. Because, like, when I first came here, I didn't know I was gonna get so close to people. And now I just have to leave them, and I just feel awful. Because I love them so much, and I, was, I had great memories with them. And a great time, all the time. And, I don't know, I, they're just part of my life. And so it's really sad to say bye to a part of your life that you really like so much. Um, today I had to leave my house and it was really awkward because like, I had to say goodbye to everybody. And my mom and Charlie brought me here to this place where like all the exchange students are. And we're gonna stay here until 1 a.m. because the bus is coming at 1 a.m. And then we're gonna drive down to New York City and our plane is like at 3 p.m. tomorrow. So we're gonna stay in New York City in a college from 1 a.m. till 11 a.m. and then take a bus that will bring us to the JFK. JFK. <laughs> so it's five in the morning and we just got here in this college, <laughs> the campus of this college. We are talking about the makeup. And see, these are the people I came here with. So we took our bus like at 1 a.m. and we got here right now. We just had breakfast, as you can tell. And we have like name tag, as you can see here, and a shirt that says Eastern New York. Uh, my bus leaves at 11 a.m., so we have to stay here until 11. Guys, I'm in the bathroom of the airplane. Isn't it weird? I mean, I've never used the bathroom now, and see, there's even a toilet. Ew. 
it's very disgusting. But like it's um 6:30 and the plane took off around 3:30 so we've been flying for 3 hours and I slept like 10 minutes and really really tired. Uh we'll be in Milan tomorrow morning at 8, at 9 a.m. But before that we have to stop at Frankfurt and it's gonna be really really long. They just gave us dinner and it was really good. We had chicken and someone else and something else. Guess what? I'm sitting next to the secretary of the United the United Nation. Well not really. I mean he's the secretary of the African part of the United Nations. I, I don't I don't even know. Look but he's really important. So like can you please reserve me a place in ten years so that I can be an interpreter there? And he's like, I think in ten in ten years I'll be dead. Like Oh, funny. But, yeah, pretty cool person. I don't know. I think I'm just gonna go back and sleep, probably. See ya. Um, so I came back to the bathroom. Because it's, like, the only place where I can take a video. And I have nothing to do. Because, like, the whole plane is black. Everybody's sleeping or watching a video, and I'm like, I have nothing to do. And in the past two days, I've slept like two hours, and oh my gosh, I need a shower. I totally, need, and you guys know how much I need showers. So like, I haven't taken a shower in two days, and as soon as I find one, I'm just gonna take it. Like, I don't even care if it's, if, it, if I can, if I have time to do it, I'm just gonna take a shower. I need to have a shower. And I basically have nothing to do. I'm really bored. Oh yeah, Kathy, I just read the letters that you wrote me, the book, the booklet, and I cried, so yeah, thank you for letting me cry again. Uh, no, actually, it was really sweet, and I got really emotional, and I really liked it. Like, you mainly said, you did a list of all the things that we did this year, and I don't know, it was really cool, all the pictures, and I went through the pictures many, many times, and I don't know, I just loved it so much. I think someone's knocking on the door, so I'm just gonna leave the bathroom now. It's a little weird, actually, because they hear people talking in the bathroom, like, whoa, who's in the bathroom? But no, I'm just taking a video, guys. Welcome in Frankfurt, Germany. Benvenuti a Francoforte, Germania. Willkommen in Frankfurt, Deutschland. So yeah, as you can see, we're finally in Frankfurt. It's like, I don't even know, 5.30 a.m. And I haven't slept. And as you know, I'm such a child. And I need at least my seven hours sleep every night. And in the past two days, I slept at least two hours. Not the most, two hours. So like, I'm dead. And now uh, my body doesn't respond to all the things that happen. So I don't know how I can like still be alive. And I keep sneezing and blowing my nose, so I guess it's like probably German air or something like that. So yeah, um, I'll talk to you later. Bye! So guys, we're at the airport now and we're just getting a luggage, as you can see. And this, my dear, is the Italian soil. So we're fin finally in Italy, in Milan. And I'm like really, really scared. I don't know. I'm like excited and scared and terrified. I'm happy and it's like so hilarious at the same time. I really don't want to meet my parents, but I know I have to. And like, um, they're waiting for me and I'm waiting for them too. But it's gonna be a little awkward, like the first time. Um, I'm definitely ahead of you now because like our time zone is like six hours ahead of you. So just remember that when we Skype. And love you guys. Next hours, 
probably I'm gonna have some pizza like Italian pizza and I'm really looking forward to it um, today in Milan we went um, to a place and we had real Italian food which was I just had a salad because I could not eat and I was really tired and I like I did not have any energies at all so it's like guys just let me stay here and die and we started walking around and we went to the dome not the dome the basilica like the really important church in Milan which was gorgeous and then we went to um, an art museum and like at first I was like, really excited to see my, my family and I talked to them a lot but then after a while I was tired um, so I don't know I just want to go home and sleep I slept in the car it took us two hours to get here in Padova finally and then we went to we went to the blockbuster blockbuster with my mom and they were playing the burlesque but it was in Italian and it, it was kind of weird because I saw the burlesque in English and then Christina Aguilera's voice was doubled like someone else was speaking for her with an Italian voice I was like no that's that's not her voice and then we were listening to something on the radio and the guy was like yeah and make sure you go to the movies to see Transformers 3 I'm like oh my gosh that's such an Italian accent so I said yeah it's Transformers but I don't know it's kind of awkward and then I was still in the car with my mom we were listening to the radio and last Friday night Katy Perry's last Friday night was playing and I was like yeah I can understand that and she could not so I had to just play the whole song for her and I don't know, I kind of feel spe I felt special a little bit. Now I really want to look for a job. Um, I'm not really sure if I can get one. But even like a summer job to get some money and... Starting... To get... Some sort of cash so that I can buy a ticket and come back soon. Um, or do whatever I want with that. Which would be really cool, really cool and I could like send boxes to you guys. And I have a few things to send. Um, so, yeah, now I'm home. I don't feel bad anymore. I just feel I'm a little tired. I want to sleep again. And I'm gonna go, I want to go on Facebook and, like, write to you guys. And, I don't know, I'll do something in my life soon. And I'll let you know. Now we're unpacking all the suitcases. And I'm going through all my clothes again, as I did Sunday. So, like... Literally, I can't remember all my clothes now. It's a little awkward. <laughs> but I keep saying awkward all the time, but it is awkward. Guys, it's odd, weird, whatever, but it is. Um, so yeah, now I think we're just going to go to my dad's house. Um, and I get to see my doggie. And she's amazing. And she's a German Shepherd. And I miss her so much. So... Um, I wish you guys the best of the luck and I'll talk to you soon and I'll post next video next Thursday. So see you Thursday. Bye guys.